Today, I'm going to be showing you guys my tragic attempt at trying to speed run the Minecraft Platinum Trophy. And why is it tragic, you say? Well, you'll see. Now, let me explain to you guys how I actually set this up. So, there's a trophy in the PS4 version of Minecraft where you have to survive a hundred days inside of Minecraft. Now, if you look up how long that actually takes, each day of Minecraft takes about 20 minutes. And if you multiply that by a hundred, the total time it takes to survive a hundred days in Minecraft is 33 hours. Now, the fear that I had for this speedrun was I was going to finish every other trophy and then essentially be waiting around fighting against the clock to try to get that trophy for surviving a hundred days. So what I went ahead and did was leave my PS5 on for 33 hours to get this trophy so I didn't have to worry about it inside of the speedrun. So then from there, how did I calculate the amount of time I had in this speedrun? In this guide on PSN profiles, this guy states that it took him about 50 days to complete every other trophy in the game. So then that made it easy enough to divide the 33 hours it takes to get that one trophy for surviving 100 days in half, which then went ahead and gave me 17 and a half hours to get every other trophy inside of Minecraft. Some trophies that I unlocked already include taking inventory getting wood benchmarking time to mine and time to strike and cow tipper so without further ado let's begin okay so once we press create and get into the game the timer will start as soon as we're loaded into the world boom timer has started and where we spawn okay I, I accidentally turned on bonus chest oh my goodness okay this is a lot of stuff so i'm gonna plan preemptively here i'm gonna get all this sugar cane we possibly can we're gonna need a bunch of sugar cane probably one of the worst spawns we could possibly get to be completely real with you there's no trees in sight i'm gonna gather there's some of this cactus as well because we will need cactus for dye later on so like i said we have 17 and a half hours to do this if doesn't that doesn't really feel like a lot of time to be honest with you that's enough cactus 15 but yeah i have actually never gotten every achievement in a minecraft game before so this is going to be interesting if i can actually do it and under the time limit oh my god this is actually a terrible spawn dude we literally spawned in the middle of a goddamn desert with no sign of trees in sight. All right, there's a cave right here. Okay, that's not bad. We do have a little bit of wood, so we can at least mine some stuff. So let's at least make some use of our time and mine, I guess. I'm not going to waste any time. We're going to go ahead and build a stone pickaxe right away. And that instantly gets us a trophy getting an upgrade. Oh my God. 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 Get away from me. Get away from me. I don't even have a sword yet, you demon. Get out. And that gets us another trophy, Monster Hunter. Two quick trophies right off the bat. And this is going to get us another trophy, Hot Topic, for creating a furnace. Did you guys see that down there? Why did those zombies just multiply? What the heck was that? Die, 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 die. No, no. I'm going to have a heart. Oh my God. I got to run. I got to run. Got to run. Got to run. Got to run. Run, run. Got to run. Got to run. Got to run. Oh my goodness. I forgot how how hard they hit. Stop crouching. What are you doing? Go. All right, new plan. I'm going to craft the boat and we're going to get out of here. It's legit about to be night and I have still not found any tree. Not one singular. I wouldn't even be able to do anything. I wouldn't even have this boat if I didn't have that bonus chest. So I was like, was it really worth it? It was the bonus chest for like any tree around. Well, is that is it not loading or is that literally just a f random floating? Okay, I know. I see some trees over there. We're good. Oh my god, dude. I've been sailing for like five minutes. Oh, squid. Squid. I should probably get that squid. Come here, squid. I need you. No, don't ink in my face. All right. Pause. Big pause on that one. I don't have time for this, you stupid squid. Give me your sack. I'm... Pause again. Holy... Sh oh god, it's dark out and it's dangerous. I cannot die here. I cannot die here. I, I, no, that's not a good idea. I, I, got, I gotta box myself in here. All right, this should give us another trophy. Time to farm. Use planks of six to make a hoe. Okay, well, that one. And then more tools. Construct one each type of whatever. Delicious fish. Okay, catch and cook a fish. I didn't catch this, but I, I got the trophy. Cool. Oh, 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 oh my God. Oh my God. Why? Why? No, leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone. Oh. oh my God. No, man. Come on. Oh, I just lost everything, dude. No way. Uh, you know what, man? No. 
The timer's gonna stay. I'm restarting. I'm restarting. Timer's gonna stay, though. All right, new world. Thousand times better this time. All right, so I think we get a trophy for eating a pork chop. So let's do that. And there you go. Pork chop. Is that a great... Okay, we need... Oh, there's a black sheep up there, too. Oh, a gray and a black sheep. We have to get those. He gave me a bow. Oh, my God. Power two, punch one on breaking one. Oh, my God. What a bow. I need to find myself a village, dude. Finding myself a village would get me a lot of trophies, man. Or a, a potential to get the trophies, like, faster. <laughs> Acquire hardware. I wasn't even going for that trophy. I was actually looking for some shears so I can shear a sheep. And that's also another trophy once we see another sheep. There we go. There we go. Have a shearful day. All right. So this trophy, we have just have to craft and place a sign. Got a sign. And there we go. It's a sign. All right. I need to find some place that I could settle in and like drop off all my stuff because I have a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff that I need. And obviously I can't spend too much time making myself a house. So all you building nerds out there who are watching this video, don't freaking bully me because I make a crap house, all right? This is a speed run. This isn't, let's build a freaking whole medieval city. Even though you guys probably can't, some of you guys probably out there probably can beat this game in 17 and a half hours, get every achievement and build a freaking medieval city. All right, I'm gonna set up shop right here. It's a nice little flat area. And what I really meant by not spending a lot of time making a house, I really meant spending an hour of my time making a house. I just spent an hour building a house. Probably not the smartest idea, but we're gonna sleep. Never mind. Oh, diamond. I swear to God, if it's one diamond, it'll get me the trophy, which would be cool. But I need more than one diamond. Okay, it's two diamonds. Diamonds, there's the trophy. Dude, the skeleton needs to... Oh, my God. Oh, there we go. It's got to be one. Oh, two. Okay, 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 okay. Give me two again. Three. Okay, I like it. I like it. Can we get a four? No, we can get a four. That's enough for at least a sword. Or no, that's at least enough for a pick and the enchantment table. So that's good. Oh, <laughs> holy crap. There we go. That's a lucky. It's one diamond, but I'll take it. All right, here we go. Enter portal into the nether. There is a trophy. Do we get a trophy for entering the nether? Okay, so it's an enchanting table and there's their trophy enchanter construct an enchantment table so that is now down as well all right this should give us another trophy for giving us a full set of iron armor no okay hold on maybe i had to put it all on at once is that how i do it is it a new set of iron armor is that why wear a full suit of iron armor so all right so there's another trophy where i had to oh my cooked beef i had to smelt charcoal or smelt wood logs using charcoal and then i get a trophy by doing that so let me just do that real quick it's a nice easy trophy oh renewable energy okay never mind i got it i guess it's just make charcoal all right so another trophy we need is create a dispenser dispense with this there it is all right this next trophy is simply for throwing a diamond at another player all right, the other account got it. There's me, diamonds to you. And that was the end of day one. After day one, as you could saw, I had 23 trophies, but I actually had 24. Here's the one that I missed. It was called Adventuring Time. And it was to discover 17 of 40 biomes. Okay, so I did a little grinding off camera. So on day two, I got right back at it. First thing I did was build a farm to get some wheat. Wheat is very important for a couple of trophies that we'll have to get. While exploring the world a little bit, I ended up killing a creeper with a bow, which granted me this trophy right here, archer, to kill a creeper with arrows. Also ended up finding a village, which was very crucial to a couple trophies that I'll need to do later. And of course, it was time for a good old classic mining trip. I'm doing take on me now. Alright. I I really I really like this song. It sounds good. Mining away. I don't know what to mine or mine this anyway. All right, so we're back. Uh, we got a couple trophies we can actually do right now. As the first trophy we're going to do is going to be making a flower pot and also putting a flower into it. So, yeah, here we go. Here's a poppy that we'll just grab real quick. And then all we got to do is make the flower pot. Then stop it. Why? 
and then we grab our flower, and then we just place the flower pot down. Oh, I guess we didn't even need to put a flower on it. The next trophy we're gonna go for is going to be crafting a piece of bread with wheat. So here we go. There we go, bake bread. Next trophy we're gonna go for is for breeding two cows. So there's one and one. Then they should make a little cow baby. There we go. Repopulation. Give me that. You're not getting out. Next trophy we're going to go for is we're going to make ourselves an iron golem. So we need some iron for that as well. We got a bunch of iron on our mining trip. And we need four blocks of iron, I think it's going to be. And this should make... Oh, place it. Iron golem. There we go. Bodyguard. There's another trophy. So yeah, now we need to find a chicken and wait for it to drop an egg. So I'm pretty sure we need one egg to bake a cake. We got some sheep in the pen as well, because we're going to start working on that color trophy. Okay, chicken, this is what we're going to do, all right? You're going to look at me. No, you're going to look at me. All right, chicken? Yeah, look at me. Right in my eyes. Right in my eyeballs. Lay an egg. I know. You can do it. You're going to be my... my. You're going to be trapped. Yeah, no, you're not going anywhere, chicken. You're, you're simply not going anywhere. You could very well escape on my half, you know, my half-baked, not-finished <laughs> roof. I got to finish that. Oh. Got my egg. Where did this, where did this chicken go? Ch chicken. Okay, you know what? I'll accept you escaping because you gave me what I needed, and that's one egg. Oh, hey, little chicken. How you doing? Come here. Come here. Come here. All right, so let's make that sugar and make our cake, and there we go. The lie. I like the I like the uh, name of that trophy. So as you can see here, we got the some different types of wool right here. We got white, gray, and black. Uh, pretty sure we can do blue right now. And red? Do you make red dye? No, I think it's stupid, but we do make blue dye. So we need all these cyan, freaking light dye, light blue dye, purple. We can also make red dye. So there is that. We're gonna dye you blue. And that should give us, or it will give us blue and red dye. So that is two more colors down. Now I just gotta keep, I think we need to find cactus though for green dye. Two more trophies that I got was this trophy right here called Return to Sender, which was for returning a fireball back out of gas. And this trophy right here called Librarian, which was simply just building a bookshelf. All right, so we have a couple more wool. We got orange, we got yellow, and we got brown. And I just made magenta and the light blue dye as well. All right, so we should get another trophy here for stopping starvation with rotten flesh. And there we go, iron belly. There is another trophy down. Now I can finally eat and be able to sprint. That took a long time. Oh my God, we got 10 ender pearls from these piglins here. Piglins, I forgot they were in the game, honestly, and they have helped out a ton. So now I don't need to do any enderman hunting. Ender pearls are 2% drop rate, and I got 10 of them. That's crazy. Oh, wait, I got these boots. Soul speed. Oh, crap. I was just looking at it. Iron boots with soul speed enchantment is 2%. Iron nuggets are 2%. Potion of uh, fire resistance is 2%. I got that. And an enchanted book with soul speed is 1%. I got a water bottle, which is 2% as well. So I got a uh, thing of fire resistance. This should be another trophy. I think if I pop this and hop in the lava here. All right, so this should give us another trophy. If we pop this, hop in there. Stay in frosty. That gives us that. All right, so this should. I got two more bookshelves. Place this bookshelf there and there and pop the sword in and boom, level 30. Sharpness 4. That is a good enchant. So here we go. Enchanting diamond pickaxe. Come on. Oh my god. Oh, I just got the god pickaxe. Holy crap. I just got the god pickaxe. All right, so unfortunately, we have to waste a diamond on making a jukebox, but it is a trophy, so I'll make it for now, and when we get a disc, we will get that trophy as well. What we really need to do is we need to get the wool going. We have, you know, all these colors. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we need six more colors, but to get some of the colors, we do need cactus at least for the two greens, you know, normal green and then a uh, light green. Is there, I don't remember if there's a dark green, but the trophy that we're gonna be grinding for a little bit here is I have efficiency five on my pickaxe now. So we're gonna work on getting this chest filled with, you know, with um, cobblestone. Um, okay. Um, I My chest is not full. But I guess I got it. I guess it must be cumulative throughout, you know, the whole world because it has to be. All right, so we're now going to start going towards the railing trophy. So we need to travel 400 or 500 blocks with rails. So I got a bunch of rails here. I think this more than I should have made, honestly. 
I just gotta place three powered rails. We'll place like four. Place this right here. Get in it. Place the thing. Let's go. This should give me the trophy. There we go. On a rail. Travel by minecart to a point at least 500 meters in a single direction. That gets it done. Now we're gonna do this all the way back. So we need cyan, which we need green dye for. We need regular green dye. We need lime dye. We need to find this flower for light gray. 10, 11, 12. So yeah, four more and then we have all 16 colors. Yeah, but I gotta go to the nether and I also gotta hit back up that uh, village I found because we need to start trading for some emeralds here. All right, time to venture over. We gotta sleep first. Time to venture over to that village. But I got a bunch of stuff with me. I looked at a bunch of trades that are possible. And I could definitely get this trophy done pretty damn fast, I'm pretty sure. But this could be the flower that gives us that, that, that dye. Hold up. And yes, light gray dye. Okay, we need these flowers. All right, I'm back. I need villager trades. I was trading with you and then you want a kamikaze off the edge? What are you doing? Get over here. I'm not done. There we go. I, okay, one more cold. The Haggler. Acquire 30 emeralds by trading with villagers. That's cool. All right, what are these? What are these uh things? I, I didn't want to buy it, but... Aqua Infinity. Okay, that's a that's a pretty good one. I'm not gonna lie. Doggy. Hi, dog. Stop it. Okay. This should be the last one. Because I did I did tame one before. There we go. Leader of the pack. Boom. Befriend five wolves. Alright, light gray is done. Do we actually did I already do light gray? Am I tripping? Or did I do normal gray? I don't remember me doing light gray though. Yeah, I never did light gray. So there we go, that's another color added. So yeah, we just need the greens now. We need cactus, man. I don't know what's up with cactus and why it's like rare as hell. Why is it that rare? Oh, overkill, I got that trophy, okay. I don't know how I did it, but I, I got it. All right, so I've gained the trust of two ocelots here and I have no trophy. I'm not really sure why. That was a waste of my time. I'm gonna go to that jungle near my house and hope that I get the trophy there. If not, then the trophy's just like glitched. It's, it's, what the hell is the wanderer doing out here? Unless you have cactus, get out of here. What do you have? You have cactus? Oh my God, you have die though. Hold up, hold up, hold up. You stay right the hell there, man. You stay right there. Do not move a singular muscle. I have just what you need, buddy. I have just what you want. Here you go. Get nine just in case. Thank you for your service. All right, I appreciate your service very much, but guess what? You're pissing me off now, so go away. All right, I think we should be able to finish our uh, our trophy here with the with the dyes. So cyan, cyan and lime, right? Okay. What's the last one we need? Just green, right? Die you, die you, die you. There we go. Rainbow collection. Boom. Gather all 16 colors of wool. Boom. All right. That's a big one done. Okay. So one day when I loaded up the world, I randomly got this trophy right here. This was the trophy for wearing a full suit of iron armor. So that is another one down. All right. Supposed to stop right in front of me. Then you start feeding. There we go. Lion hunter. Okay. So I did it wrong. All right. Now I need to hit the nether. I feel like now's the time where we really, we need to find a fortress and that could take a while, man. It could take a while. So my journey in the nether began and here is where things just started all going downhill from here. So I went a very long time in the nether without actually finding a nether fortress. I wasted a good hour looking for one. And then this happened. Take a look. That's it. That's it. It's over. <sighs> I just pressed the wrong button. All right, let's get this trophy done with at least. One pig's fly trophy. Put a saddle on this bad boy. And then fall down here. And when pigs fly, use a saddle to ride a pig and blah, blah, blah. Thank you. And now we can finally complete this trophy. There we go. Okay, so this trophy was really annoying me. So I set up this little redstone mechanism so I can easily kill a skeleton with an arrow from more than 50 blocks. So I actually had to spawn in another player for this. So I decided to go split screen. And once I pressed this button right here, I finally got the trophy sniper duel. So after I died that first time in the nether, I decided not to give up. I decided to go back into the nether and venture to find another fortress. And I eventually did. Once I found this fortress, I found hope again. I thought maybe I can do this. 
this. I still had plenty of time. I still had about three hours to go. I even managed to find some blaze and kill them to get the trophy for that as well. I had enough blaze to make potions and also go to the end. But unfortunately, this happened. From that point on, I forfeited. I gave up on the speed run. I deleted the world. I did end up finishing the platinum though. Here is me defeating the ender dragon and getting the platinum right there. But yeah, that was the end. So yes, I got the platinum, but I did fail the speed run. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Here is a playlist of all my other platinums right here.